This is the coolest breakdown. So in this video, I'm going to be breaking down the rise and fall of Nickelodeon Gas. Now Nickelodeon Games and Sports for Kids stylized as either Nick Gas or Nickelodeon Gas and commonly known as Nick Gas was an American cable television network that was part of MTV Network's suite of digital cable channels. Now the channel was available to all digital cable providers and satellite providers of Dish Network with its focus on classic Nickelodeon game shows, some of which have been removed from the parent network Nickelodeon between 1999 and 2002. Now, the rise. Nick Gass was essentially a children's version of and Viacom's answer to Game Show Network which launched on December 1st, 1994. Nickelodeon Games and Sports for Kids, or just Nickelodeon Gast, was announced on November 3rd, 1998. Now, the channel had been in development for months as Nickelodeon conducted research among children to determine their sports-related interests. Nick officially launched Gas on March 1st, 1999. Now, upon launch, Nick Gas reached less than a million of the 70 million plus cable and satellite subscribers in the US at the time. Now, however, it soon became one of the most sought after channels among cable operators, and its programming primarily consisted of children's game shows and sports related programs from its parent channel network. Nickelodeon. Nick Gas also produced its own original programming, such as Play the Z, Game Farm, and Splash TV. Now, Gas also featured original blocks, such as Camp Gas during the summer, Double Dare Double Play, and Pumping Gas. In place of commercials, Nick Gas aired educational segments and at times featured famous athletes. Nick Gas is often included into Nickelodeon's golden age for programming and entertainment. Now will Nickelodeon ever have a run like this again? <laughs> Let's hope so. I know I do. Now the fall. The channel's target audience seemed to have just grown up and stopped really tuning into gas as much as before as they were. And looking back, <laughs> I was one of those kids. Now, this isn't uncommon, of course, and the channel ended up depending on reruns. So this led to Viacom announcing on August 13th, 2007, that Nick Gas would shut down at the end of the year. It was replaced by a 24 hour version of Noggin's Teen, Oriented Block, The End, which started airing on Noggin in mid 2002. On December 31st, 2007, Nick Gass officially closed at 6 a.m. Eastern Time after an episode of Figure It Out. Now, you can argue that Nickelodeon Gas officially closing down in late 2007 also signaled the end of one of Nickelodeon's golden ages. Now, if you're into content like this, go ahead and subscribe, hit the notifications bell, like, comment, share, and follow my Instagram down below in the description. Alright, I'm out. I appreciate y'all. Peace.